we'll just put some there too. Okay, so now what we would do is we'd be uh, coming along here. And then when we get to here, we just go up to here. Oh, that's nice. I like it. Me likey. Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Leg Sam and Old Guy Gaming. And in this episode, at least to start with, uh, I'm going to be gathering a bunch of resources. Uh, I often say that um, I'm going to do this off camera, but I've got a bad feeling about this. I haven't really been doing a whole lot of off camera stuff just because of time. I've got a bunch of other things going on, too. So it's better just to to keep getting the episodes out, but not, you know, not go too crazy on the on the boring stuff. So I'll show some of it to you, but not all of it. Uh, but anyway, the goal really is just to kind of work my way back to the base and in the process pick up chrysanthemum, goldenrod, stone, which I'm just going to get from surface stones for now. Um, I guess we could... Nah, we don't need coal. We don't need any coal right now. We're good. And um, then when we get back to the base, we will... Um, I might actually take you guys down into my mine um, and try a little experiment with uh, some ladders that you guys had, had mentioned. Um, basically, the idea is to put the ladders kind of along a wall, and then when I get encumbered, jump on the ladders and then kind of shimmy across to get to the main ladder going up. Uh, I want to try that and see if it works and if it's, you know, if, if it's practical. So, yeah, we'll do that. Now, the other thing is, I have some bad news, and that is that if you look in the lower left-hand corner of the Grim Reaper's back, uh, I did try and do a little bit of gathering at night, and I got overwhelmed, and they took me out. So, yeah, I know. I know better than to do that, but sometimes I take the chance anyways, and sometimes I pay the price for it, and this is one of those times. So, it's not that I'm stupid, it's just that sometimes I take a chance, and sometimes I'm successful, but this time I wasn't, so there you go. Um, let's put him out of our misery. There we go. Uh, anyway, yeah, so not a big deal. I mean, you know, we're, we're pretty high level now. We got pretty good gear, so it sucks, but it's not, it doesn't m majorly set us back when Grim Reaper shows up, so. Uh, but I am just going to work my way back to the base, and when we get back to the base, I'll bring you guys uh, back at that time, if I don't have a good reason to bring you back before then. And then we'll go do some stuff down in the mine. So, yeah, see you guys in a bit. Here, let's use this. All right, guys, we are back at the base. Uh, we're going to do a few things whilst we're here. First of all, I got um, quite a few uh, things of chrysanthemum and goldenrod. And I did pick up just a little bit more uh, clay, too. Or not clay, I'm sorry, coal powder. So uh, let's make some coal powder. And then I got a whole mess of stone, like over 3,000 small stones. And 17,000 large stones. So I just hit like the really the really large boulders uh, as we went along. So we got that done and we'll get that stuff started. Let's grab a hundred of those. And then for mineral water, uh, yeah, we got a total of 58 goldenrod and 300 chrysanthemums. So we'll make seven more of those. And then for... 
Uh, here, let's turn that. Well, no, let's actually save that murky water there. I want to make a whole, just a metric butt ton of mineral water. So we haven't actually set our well up. Let's do that. I haven't really, whoops, wrong room. I haven't really needed to, you know, because we've, we just brought so much water with us. Um, and isn't there like, um, isn't there like a more advanced well that we could do? Not there, but it might be called something else. Water. Water pump. Oh my goodness, that takes an auger, huh? You know what, though? We don't need our auger, actually, <clears throat> for any reason, other than looking at potentially what other re uh, recipes might require it. Ore extractor and oil extractor. And a Valkyrie drill. Oh. We could make a tier 3 one of these. Oh, no, that's the research station. Right, okay. Um, slowly refills with murky water one unit every minute from deep within the soil, less contaminated by radiation. Okay. Um, these would be nice to actually have. If I remember right, though, in... Um, Undead Legacy, when I played it before, unless he's buffed these, they didn't really... Oh, has a small chance to extract titanium ore. They didn't really... I wasn't very impressed with them. They didn't... They took a long time, and they didn't give you very much ore. So if you guys happen to know if these have been improved since about a year and a half ago, I think that's the last time I played. Maybe only a year ago. I can't remember now. Let me know that, but I wasn't very impressed with them, um, you know, back when I played before. Oil extractor, I mean, yeah, that'd be kind of nice, but it's so easy just to take, you know, the Valkyrie and go out into the desert and just get a metric butt ton of oil shell that I'm not so sure I would want to spend resources on that. So I do like the idea of, of this. Is this any better, though, than the well? So this is one unit every minute. What does the well do? One unit every two minutes. I see. Okay, so this is just, this is about twice as fast. Gotcha. Okay. Now, if we wanted to be somewhat realistic about this, though, this really should be down below, shouldn't it? Um, all right. Yeah, let's be somewhat realistic about it. So what we'll do is uh, we got to make it first. So did we make that in here? Yeah. Uh, oh, no, we don't. We make it in the workbench. Okay, so what what I'll do is I'll I'll put that all the way back down at the bottom of the elevator shaft so it's going underground, <laughs> and then we can load it up from there and then just go up the ladder with big loads of water. Okay, so that's cool. We got that done, and we don't really need the well anymore. I'll hang on to it just for the heck of it. Why not? We got room for it, so yeah, we'll hang on to it. Okay, now you also reminded me in the comments that I do in fact know how to make antibiotics. I just completely forgot that I knew, knew that because I, you know, I just, I always think of honey. Uh, no, actually, hold on. Uh, I don't know how to make herbals, but I do know how to make these. Oh, that's cheap, man. That's like really cheap. Okay. Then uh, does it have to be, it probably has to be the mineral water in the jars though. Let's just see what it does. Um, chemistry bench, right? Yeah, I'm thinking it has to be that kind of mineral water. And I don't have any made, but I could make some. Let's make... If I have enough resources, I'm just going to make 10 of these antibiotics. We've got, we've got the stuff for it, man. Oops, wrong thingy. No, right thingy. Where'd it go? Right here. Okay, so we're going to have to make up some um, mineral water. Let's put a little bit of wood in there, too. So let's make 10 of those, and this is nothing, and that, you know, I've got tons of those, too. This is actually really cheap. Uh, okay, so let's make 10 mineral waters from the jar.
There we go. So that'll take a little over three minutes, and then we'll just make ten antibiotics, and we'll be good. Uh, we might as well, you know, I did bring back some honey, though, so we might as well do that, too. Um, but after that, I don't need to go after honey any longer. There's there's no reason to. When it, when the when the best antibiotics are that simple and easy to make, we got lots. Uh, well, actually, you know what? I guess we don't have a lot of sham sandwiches. Thought I had more of those. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's still enough for us to make how many? Those are waiting in there for schematics. Five. Okay, so we can make um. Four, because we have 24 sandwiches. Can you make chamois? I don't think you can. No, you can't. Okay. Well, we'll just have to be... I mean, I typically grab those anyways, because I know we need them, need them for medical stuff, so we'll just continue to grab them. I thought I had more than that, but still, not a big deal. With the, with the honey we can make, as well as the four big, big antibiotics, uh, we'll be fine for a while. Okay, so that takes care of that. Let's put this stuff in here. Um, I'm going to actually just keep those in my inventory because we're going to be putting that water pump. Well, actually, though, yeah, we could put it in there and then I got an idea. Actually, here, let's do this. Let's take a couple of stacks of jars and a couple of stacks of empty plastic bottles and just a little storage container. And we'll just keep that right next to the well. And then every time I pass by it, I'll stop and fill them up. I don't want to put them in my drop chest because my drop chest I usually just do a take all and I'll forget that and then I'll take these back up when I didn't mean to. We are hungry ladies and gentlemen and we have lots of good food so why don't we chow down on some spaghetti. No actually let's have the shepherd's buy so that way we can free up a spot in here. <clears throat> Excuse me because I did have to put uh, some meat in here which is really supposed to go in here and now let's what kind of good food can we make um, don't want to make any of these until we get more, uh, mushrooms, which we will from our farm. And that's really it. We don't really need to make anything else right now. Because, you know, I want to save my ingredients for the, for the high-end stuff as much as possible. Okay, let's grab these. And, oh, I put the... Let's grab these, and we needed nitrate, I think it was, right? Yeah. All right, so we'll bust out four of those. How long is that going to take? Four minutes. Everything's taken four minutes. Well, not quite. All right, put that in there. I'll put those in there, too, because they are also medical items. Very good. Okay, so let's see. We got um, antibiotics made. We're just kind of waiting on... This other stuff that's just about ready. We'll take the we'll take the water pump down below, and then we're gonna head down into the mine, and we're gonna try a little experiment. Oh my word! Look at all this stuff in here. Um, okay, here. Let's put a stack of you in there. Just need to be able to move here for a second. The fuel bricks. Um, let's put the fuel bricks. It doesn't really matter where we put them. Here, we'll put them in here. And here's our lock picks, by the way, that we made in the the last episode. And we're just oh man, we're making so much wood. It's crazy. It's a good thing though. Okay, so I want to make. Uh, I just want to make the wood frame version. Yeah, I'm just going to make a bunch of these, and then we'll turn them into ladders. So I don't know how many we're going to need. We got so much wood now. Let's let's make 42. And we'll re-queue up these. 185. Now, let's we want to save some wood. Let's just make 100 more of these, which I think yeah translates into 1,000 or more. Nice. We are doing good on resources, peeps. 
Throw all that stuff in there and grab that thing a thousand planks and put that in there too. Look at all that wood. That's awesome. Okay, uh, here's a couple ladders here too. We might as well take those down with us. Is the water pump done? It should be. It is indeed. Okay, so we got the water pump done. Uh, you're not doing anything. Let's take two of those with us. Uh, we'll grab those, and these are for medicinal purposes. So, I think... Oh, we can use snowballs to make those. That's funny. Okay, I think we're done with the campfire for now, so let's turn the fire off. Save some uh, some fuel there. And I'm just going to put the big antibiotics back in the medical chest, and we'll carry the honey with us, and we'll use that up first. And we'll put those in the medical chest, too, for medical reasons, not for drinking reasons. And we got nine plastic bottles of mineral water. Beautiful. In fact, we could stand to take one of those right now. Let's do it. We don't need to carry those around. And are we ready to go? You're just working on stuff here. In fact, you know what? Let's let's get the other stone dust going in this one. So we're doubling up our efforts here. And uh, I don't even know where I keep this. In here, probably? Yeah, in there. Okay. It's a beautiful thing. Oh, gas. Yeah, we need we need gas. I've got a whole crap ton of partials. You know, if I had a gasoline can, I could dump those out and consolidate them. I know we had that back at the original rooftop base. All right, I'm going to have to grab a gasoline can and bring it up here for that purpose, to consolidate our fuel. But for the moment, let's just make... Well, let's take all the empties that we have. In fact, too, here, let's just grab all of these for a second. Uh, make sure all of these are fueled up. Uh, let's jump on down um, and make sure the motorcycle is fully fueled up. I don't know why I wasn't getting any sound from that, but I wasn't. Okay, so we will put our our water chest here. Get it up high enough so the Zeeks can't hit it. And we're going to need to put our fuel, or not our fuel, but our water pump. Oh, uh, you know what? It can't go there because that's a, like a half block, right? Oh, we could put it right there. I kind of wanted it in the corner, though. Will you get out of here? I'm stuck. Come on, Roberta. She's totally got me pinned down here. Okay. Where are we going? Get out of the way. There we go. There's our water pump. Okay, and it'll start to fill up. Okay, now we will put all of our empties in here. And we will, like I said, slowly start to uh, fill those up as we go along. Fantastic. All right. Make sure you're completely fueled up. Oh, it looks like you are completely fueled up. Uh, fuel, fuel, gas. Yep, you're completely full. Okay. So, um, let's... Let's actually see if we can find a a fuel tank somewhere nearby so we can call it, consolidate these. We'll do that first. This is going to be another kind of one of those variety episodes, but that's good. I like the variety episodes. It gives us something different to do so we're not doing the same thing all the time. Um, all right. We probably better grab the motorcycle because it's... It might be a little ways out before we find our a fuel thingy. Hopefully not too far, though. 
Um, actually, here, let's go this way, because there's a gas station right down the road. Did we ever hack this thing? We didn't. Let's do it. Counterclockwise. Ooh, that one was just ready to break. Counter oh, look at that. Counterclockwise. Okay, we're one for one. $449 Mickey Hala. There's probably going to be some Zeke's around here. Never looted this stuff, huh? Oh shit, not good. I I give up. There's no point in trying to remember to load my weapon in this game because I'm just never going to do it. That's all I got to say about it. <laughs> All right, come on. There's got to be a fuel barrel back here somewhere. Come here, Steve. Anybody in here? Seriously, there's no fuel barrel back here anywhere. What the heck? Oh, we'll take this, though. Where is me shovel? Where is me shovel? Do I not have me shovel? What happened to me shovel? I don't have my shovel. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Crap. There's a couple things of concrete back here. Oh, uh, okay. Well, no fuel canister there at the gas station. What is up with that? Ow. Okay, let's go this way. Let's see. Where else can we look? Do 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 do. Um, sometimes you can find them in barns. Is this that place that has that whole big underground tunnel thing going on? Let's take some meds. And then we'll need to counter it with that. Huh. Oh, now I can't get out. <laughs> really? Okay, well, I guess we'll go around this way. Can't open that door. We're going to have to lockpick this thing. Open. Look at that. We're two for two. I'm going counterclockwise. Oh, this is one of those generator dealios, huh? Oh, there's a fuel pan right there. Exactly what we needed. All right, let's, um, do, do, do. I didn't bring any fuel cans with me, did I? Or did I keep them in here? What did I do with them? I left them back at the base. Son of a beech nut. Nothing's working today. <laughs> Crap. Crapola. All right, well, um, let me run back and grab some gas cans. Okay, we got some gas cans. And now we can pick this up. All right, cool. So that should allow us to consolidate our gasoline. I'll keep that in there. Uh, I'm debating whether or not I want to actually go down here and just maybe see if we can, oh shit, find some fun, but I, I also want to, you know, try that mining test too, so.
Whoa. Is this the fat loot's room? Nothing in there. There's some fat loots up there. Zombies? Oh, I got a little bit of a parkour thingy here. There's a water barrel. You know, it might actually be useful to have one of those up stairs too. Except for, I don't think I have enough jars to fill it all, or to empty it, I should say, on me. It needs two more charges. And I don't want to drink two mineral waters. Uh, here, let's drink a couple coffees. I got lots of coffee. What's this, beer? Do we have the thing that, here, let's, let's see. Do I get, nope. <laughs> we don't have the thing that removes the side effects. Okay. All right, well, we'll be buzzed for a little bit then. Okay, this ought to make things even more interesting. How do I get... Uh, oh, here we go. I don't think I've ever done this POI before. I, I watched somebody else, I don't remember who it was, do it. But I, I haven't done it myself. This is fun. Doing this while... Oh, yeah, there's lots of fat loots there. Woohoo! All right. Do we have our luckies on? We should. I mean, that's what I wear all the time. I don't have any eye candy with me, but whatevs. Shotgun parts. Unlock this guy. Counterclockwise. Oh, good. The blur just wore off. Okay. There we go. There were two for three today. Steel katana. Uh, don't really care about that. We'll scrap it. Get the get the stuff. That's the problem with finding such a nice, you know. Oh, that's good. You know, blade early on is every blade thing you find thereafter. Don't really want. We'll scrap that. Ooh. That's a nice little grave digger thingy. Uh, we would want to put that on the the Valkyrie drill. Can we though? Does this even have mod slots? It does. There we go. Nice. Okay, I think that's it for around in here, and enough screwing around for today. Let's go back. Uh, get down into the mine. There's probably not going to... We, well, we, yeah, we just got the fat loots. Let's go. There's not going to be any fat loots. There might be like one or two crates, but nothing super good. So let's just go. Okay, so for now, let's put the fuel barrel just right here. Remember, everything that you guys see up here is temporary in terms of where it's placed. All right, now, if we take all of our partials... In add to the barrel. Add, yeah, add. Oh, it, yeah, it pulls out the first time. That's right. I forgot about that. Okay. You can also um, hold E and then just use the radial menu too, which is probably faster. Definitely faster. So you don't have to do it twice. Okay, it looks like that consolidates everything there. Uh, let's put our water barrel. Oh, this is one of those stupid sideways ones. Can I rotate this? Yeah, it's not, <laughs> it's not, it's not going to uh, sit up right because it's, it's supposed to be at an angle. So, all right. Well, this isn't really going to do us any good. 
Not a big deal. We'll find another one later. I'm just going to stick it in here. Okay. Um, looks like we have a critical. So we'll fix that. And let me just put a couple of odds and ends away here. I want to scrap you and scrap you. We're going to have to have a shopping, uh, or more specifically, a selling day here in the next couple episodes, I think. Very good. Okay, so we have 14 fuel cans. Uh, you need to go in there. Actually, here, let's turn you into more mineral water. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, it has to first be normal water, right? Okay. Uh, what were we saying now? We as in me? I was saying something. Oh, yeah, fuel. So, let's see. We just basically need more firewood. Uh, it's coal powder and oil shale. Yeah, lots of coal powder and oil shale, I think, is right here. Yeah, lots of oil shale. Oh, that's a lot of oil shale. Like, a little too much there. Can I still move? Barely. Okay, so the thing is, is we can only do... Here, let's pull that out of there. Once that's done, we can only do six cans at a time, because then it fills up and it doesn't... It keeps burning fuel, but it doesn't stop. So, yeah. All right, so we'll wait for that to finish, and then I'll make more fuel after the first six are are, are completed. I'm just going to keep that this stuff in here for that purpose. And let's stick the extra bit of this in here. And we'll make some more mineral waters. That's only going to require one minute and 20. Okay. Oh, that's that that's fast. Okay, here. Let me just finish these out real quick. Okay, that is the last of the fuel. We're a little bit pudgy right at the moment, but we have a, a nice little supply of fuel now. That many to be precise, plus these two. Okay, I'm going to take those with us, and um, let's go ahead and repair this. Oh, we need steel. All right, what do we have going on smelting-wise? Steel ingot. Do we have any iron ingots made up? We don't. And we don't have any ore either. Oh my goodness, really? Okay. Iron ingot here. Let's... We don't need that much scrap, so... Let's turn... Let's make, say, 225. Okay, now I'm going to quickly make some steel ingots so that I can then make uh, we'll just do 200 here okay now I should be able to make these plating thingies and dang is that going to be enough I don't remember what it said we needed to to repair this it is. Just barely. Okay, because I want to... Uh, obviously, I want to mine some iron while we're down there because we need to. Uh, sort that. Okay. I think we're ready to head on down, folks. Uh, we are a little bit hungry. How about a fish taco? There we go. All right. So our goal, while I still have you, is to... <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, try this little ladder trick that you guys were telling me about.
Do we have somebody's attention? I hear footsteps. Uh, I don't know. Here, let's deal. Let's deal with this Yahoo because I don't want him up here banging on the on our stuff while we're down below. Over here, Bubba. Have a headache. All right, let's head on down. Head on down to the mine. Okay, so I believe the idea here was to put ladders along the wall, and then when we're encumbered, we could just shimmy along the ladders. Now, the other question, though, about that is... Is that going to actually be faster than just going here, put everything in there, going here, pull out, put in, pull out, put in? I mean, yeah, that's another consideration because if it's not going to be really any faster than that, then it's this isn't necessarily going to be all that worthwhile. But let's just try it. Let's just give it a try. Um, and I think we're going to need to make this at least three high. Oh, I gotta, I gotta get my shovel, man. Um, let me, let me go grab my shovel really quick, cause we need it. crap so much for grabbing my shovel really quick that's the problem with mining is uh, we attract screamers like really fast coming to papa okay Are we clear? Oh, you know what? I can't say come to Papa when we have little friend out because Papa's our shotgun. We gotta get these things right, man. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Um, let's grab these. And we're gonna change them to ladders. I might be able to get away with just one row here. Yeah, that's that's enough to test it. Okay, so we get on the ladder. Oh uh, wait, I don't. Are we on the ladders? I don't think we're on them. Okay, you know what? Let's just. The nice thing about this is if this doesn't work, I can just pick these all back up again. Okay, so. Now we're on the ladder. Are we? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, we're definitely on the ladders. Oh, and we, yeah, we can shift, uh, shift, shift. Yeah, press shift to sprint on these ladders. You know, that actually probably will work okay. If, if I'm sprinting, that is, that's definitely going to be faster than stopping, you know, and using the crates all the way back. I like that idea. I think that'll work. Okay, so let's, um, let's go ahead and get these all the way back to here. And then, you know, once we get to here... We can reach this chest to, to load stuff up um, because I don't think I can get underneath this. That would be kind of nice, though. Oh, actually, I got an idea. I got 
I got me an idea. Here, let's remove this. We'll just put some there too. Okay, so now what we would do is we'd be uh, coming along here. And then when we get to here, we just go up to here. Oh, that's nice. I like it. Me likey. <laughs> All right, you guys. Yeah, this is this was a great idea. Um, whoever left this comment, uh, I can't remember because it was actually a quite a while ago. Thank you very much, man. What a great uh, what a great idea. If uh, if I can, you know, well, I'll tell you what. Save me some time if you would, and just let me know in the comments if that was you. And then I'll give you a shout out in the next episode because I don't remember exactly how long ago it was that this was suggested, but it's been a while. That's really slick, though. I like that. Absolutely like that. So, yeah, if we're I mean, we still have the problem, of course, of getting all the ore to here. But the idea now is that, in fact, you know what? Let's um, let's pick this up. The idea now is that we just get the ore to here in smaller loads, right? And then once that's full, we hop on the ladder, open this up, grab the ore, and then just shimmy. Oh, that is a cool setup. I love it. Very neat. Okay. Um, that means we probably don't even really need these anymore either. So why don't we pick these up and we'll just keep them stored down here. And I can, you know, potentially use them for, you know, further out. I really like this, though. Yeah, that one's got to stay. Well, actually, that one doesn't necessarily need to stay there, but I think I'll keep it there anyway, just in case. We could even, um, we could even carve another, well, we don't really need to, though, because, yeah, once I'm on these ladders, I'm on them. And I don't think, I don't think this wall, side wall is really causing us any trouble. So, yeah, we'll just keep it the way it is. All right, you guys, that is awesome. Well, you know what? Since I am down here, I am going to go ahead and do some mining primarily for iron or actually what we could do. Yeah, iron or get, see what I did there? <laughs> uh, anyway, I was thinking about building a road, just meaning clearing a path out to our titanium mine. And there's iron out there too. And then we could do like just a big, my plan here is to do a big massive strip mine, but what will, as far as the Zeeks go, what we might do is put like a fence or something around the pit and maybe even some spikes. So that way when it calls the zombs in, you know, they're not just jumping down on our head left and right. And then we can get titanium and iron and whatever else we run into out there. I like that idea. You know what? Maybe that's what we'll do for the next episode. What we could do is just get to the end of this road here, and then we'll just clear a path to the mine, Um, you know, from here to here. So it's just nice and clear, and there's not a bunch of debris and crap in the way. And then, yeah, I think that's what we'll do. All right, so next episode, guys, we're going to start our open pit mine here in the titanium mine, but with defenses. That is the plan. So I'm going to make, I'll probably make iron spikes to outline the edge, but I'd kind of like to also put a, like maybe almost a wall up, which means we're going to need concrete. We're going to want to use concrete for that at least. So, all right, well, I'm going to stay down here anyways, nevertheless, and, and get some iron, um, get a load of iron so we can get that going. And uh, when we start the next episode, the plan will be to go set up our open pit mine out there in the wasteland. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment to share out the video. Let's grab some coffee because that gives us a little bit of a buff here. And I think I have some Rockbusters too, but let's save that for the titanium mine. Yeah, I just completely butchered my outro. So bye. Me no likey screamers.